channel. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Tia. I upload four times a week: Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday. I do mostly synthetic wig-related content here. We are multicultural. We are inclusive. So if you haven't subscribed, please do so. What am I like? <laughs> if you have one of my little doll babies, hi, doll baby. How are you? So happy that you are here. Okay, so today I am doing um, a video testing out a wig shine spray, but I wanted to do it with this gorgeous, gorgeous girl. This is one of my favorite wigs, period, point blank. I've had her at least five different times, I think, in different colors. I've caught her. I have many, many videos, many, many videos on her. And this is Valentino. And I have Valentino in the color FF Hot Choco or Hot Coco, which is I absolutely love. I've had her in this FF Golden Brown color as well. And there's other colors too. FF Cream. Yeah, FF Cream I've had her as well. I scooped this particular one at Poshmark, but you can get her in a lot of places. I will include my original review and any other videos that I have on Valentino. I'm going to actually be doing another video with her, comparing her to a different color. And then also, there is a newer version of Valentino. And I am going to be comparing the old version versus the new. So there will be many, many videos on Valentino because I love her. But today, I just wanted to try and test out this wig spray. And... This particular one, I've worn her a few times, and I think that there's just certain wigs that they're already a little bit shiny, and you want to put, like, powder on them. But this one, I feel like I want to see what would happen if I use a wig, wig charge spray, a wig shine spray. So, that's what we're doing today. That's something you're interested in? Stick around, because that's what we're doing today on this video that you're watching. So, this wig shine, why can't I say wig shine spray? This is from Bonfi. Bonfi Natural, and it says oil-free wig shine, UV protector, and vitamin E for dull or dry human and synthetic hair. I got it from Ebony Line for $2.95, so that's what it looks like right there. Well, it says, I don't know why I'm trying to read the directions without my glasses on. Hold bottle six to eight inches. From your head and spray and it says you're supposed to scrunch or move through with your fingers i got this new brush it's it's from uh it's a revlon wig brush but it was a gift from somebody that i bought wigs from on poshmark and i'm like obsessed with this brush obsessed so let's give this a whirl and see what happens all right i'm gonna shake it six to eight inches i'm like hmm I'm very, very sensitive to smells. This smells like fake cotton candy smell. So it's not horrible, but there is a smell to it. Ooh. It even feels easier to brush through, to be honest with you. It definitely needs to dry. Um, I can comb through it better, so that's already something better. I think I might have used a little bit too much. I feel like with these wigs, especially when they're lighter in the front, they get really wonky right here. So I want to work it through on there. I mean, it definitely feels different. It feels silkier. Um, it's not giving it a shine like shiny, like I need to put dry shampoo on it. Okay, let's do this one and let me just do more of a... Kitten. She's behind the curtain. She's always doing something. She's always like doing something. She always seems like she's up to something. I can see a little bit of a difference. Um, these areas here I feel like look a little dry. So you know what? I'm gonna actually just spray this on my hand. I think that would be like better oh yeah yeah 
to get in these like dry ends. Okay, mm -hmm. look, it's like really making those highlights pop, I think. Yeah. I don't know if you can see her, but she's like literally on the actual curtain, like hanging on it. Oh yeah, see, let's look at it. Okay, now that it's sort of soaking in, I definitely see a difference. I hope that it's showing up. It's just less dry looking. It wasn't terribly dry looking until I put this on, then I was like, oh. But just in general, running my fingers through it, brushing it, it's like not catching. Um, it's helping, yeah, yeah, yeah. It just feels better. I like the smell, I think. I'm always interested in things for wigs that smell a little bit just because you know when you're wearing wigs and you're sweaty like they can smell funny um so anything that could actually help that smell um without putting additional products on I think is really good so yeah okay so live and learn I put way too much on this side I think this side is the perfect amount you can see right here it's just a little bit too much right there <laughs> So as I promised in other videos, this is me later on in the day and I have more thoughts about the wig shine spray. So I wanted to make sure to include it. Now that it's sort of seeped in and it's not so like wet, uh, I definitely feel that it making it way easier to brush and it is giving it a really nice luster. It's not like shiny which is what I was a little bit afraid of because you know I don't like a shiny wig I like a, a matte more of a matte version wig but I do think that it's giving it a little something in terms of uh, stepping the luster up so that I'm really really happy with so now that it's dry you can kind of see what the end result would look like and this is what it is I do think that it made a difference, especially with brushing. I unfortunately don't have wigs that are super, super, you know what? I have older wigs. Um, I will do a follow up video and I will get some like wigs that I've definitely worn like a lot. Although I've worn this wig about mm, four times or so. Uh, but just to see if there's damage, if it would like sort of fix it. But I do think that it is making it look a little bit more lustrous and yeah it's definitely making it easier to comb through so I would say uh, for $2.95 you really can't go wrong if that is something that you are looking for overall I'm really happy with using this so my first impressions and lessons and now I will continue to use this in other videos and uh, I'll do an update this is more of like a first impressions but I like the smell of this. I, I love the price. The price is a steal. So this is the only wig shine spray I've tried so far. I do have some other, if you have other ones you would like me to try and then maybe do like a roundup review, go ahead and put that down below. So far so good. I think it does work. It's definitely making it like, look at this, easy for me to run my fingers through. I just think that uh, less is more and I found it worked better when I sprayed it like on my hand as opposed to directly on the wig. So that is what I found out thus far on my beautiful Valentino. Also, if you have, um, if you have Valentino or have tried Valentino, what do you think of her? You know, she's one of those like sort of like Nisha style, like people love her or they hate her. To me, Valentino, it's just, it's so easy to wear and put on and to look natural. Um, if I'm running late, uh, this is the wig I usually go with just because I know it's going to look cute no matter what. So that's what I have for you for this little first impression on the wig spray. If you have additional wig sprays you would like me to try, please put that down below. If you have any tips or tricks, um, go ahead and put that down below. If you like these types of videos, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. Let's hit the little bell so that you get notified with all of my content. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. I might have already said that. If you have, you're my doll baby. I'll see you later, doll baby. Bye.